Hello everyone, it's me Jebby from Inic Tutorials. Today, in this video, I will show you how to get computer like on screen keyboard with Ctrl, Alt, and function keys in Android smartphones. So, without further more delay, let's begin. So, right now, you can see my Android home screen, right? So, you can see our default on screen keyboard that is the Android keyboard. As you can see, we don't have any Control all or function case like a FN case or F1, F2, F3, whatever function case. So we don't have such option. So firstly, let me show you. So this is the on-screen computer keyboard. So you can see here we have a control key FN that is the function keys, and you can see there are tons of other keys. Right. So how you can get such kind of similar looking computer like on screen keyboard on our android smartphone so for this what you need to do is just open the play store and in the play store just search for one application name as hackers keyboard to search this application on the first list you will see the application just tap on it and just tap on install to install this application so wait for a few seconds until the complete installation is done so once the installation is done just tap on open now on the above you will see option enable keyboard just tap on it and now you can see your hackers keyboard just enable it click on ok click on ok move back and now the second option set input method just select it now select the hackers keyboard now you can see your option to test right so you can just tap on it and now you will see the hackers keyboard has been enabled so right now you can see our basic keyboard so we don't have any control old or function keys right so for this just tap on this settings option and now you can see your keyboard mode on the portrait layout so right now it's selected in the four row gingerbread layout now you can see the last option full five row layout just you can select this and now just move back and once again tap on this test return so now you can see below there is a control icon on the left side and even you can see a uh, alt that is a l t written even there is a escape e s c written and even there is a f n key that is a function key so if you click on this f n key so you will see here all the function keys that is F1, F2, F3, whatever you are seeing, and even you can see there is a screen lock, num lock, and even the up, down, right, left arrow icon also available there. Even the page up, page down, home, delete, and similarly looking with the computer like keyboard, right? So, thus the functions that is which we use a shortcut computer keyboard shortcuts actually works here or not so let me show you say in order to select the enter text what we used to do in our computer keyboard we used to press ctrl a right so here by default here it's set to ctrl alt a but you can change it that option by going to the settings so here you can see instead of ctrl a by default it has been enable with the control alt a so you can disable this control alt a and you can use a control a if you want to use a control a like computer no override so you can see here and let us move back and let us try the selecting this text by typing the control a so let me click on control I click on control and let me click on a now you can see uh, blue rectangle separate marking you can see and enter text word so that means I have selected the enter text right as exactly like the computer keyboard now I want to cut it right so in our computer keyboard we used to press ctrl x so let us try the similar method let me click on ctrl and now let me click on x now you can see we have cut the text now let us paste as exactly we used to do in the computer keyboard like pressing ctrl b to paste the cut or any selected text so let me press ctrl 
and B voila so it's perfectly working like the computer keyboard is not it right so using this keyboard name as hackers keyboard you can easily get computer like on-screen keyboard with control alt and function keys in Android smartphones so if you never known about this cool application then you should definitely give it a try so if you find this video tutorial useful please click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching